James Kaufman, World News Report. Today, July 26, 2024, God bless you and yours, no matter where you are in the world. Please subscribe, give us a thumbs up, ring that bell for critical future updates. Ladies and gentlemen, in northwest central Texas, we've been having a swarm of earthquakes over about the past week, and I want to address that swarm and look into it a little bit further with you guys. So, Let's use the USGS and zoom into that area in Texas. First, I want to point out, I have been in the oil and gas business for over 35 years and actually did oil and gas leasing and legal contractual work for several oil and gas companies. And I was actually in charge of leasing many of these areas, if not all of these areas, for most of the major oil companies. So I'm very familiar with these areas. Now, I will admit that the fracking going on in this swarm is unusual. Everything you see here in Oklahoma, in the Panhandle, or in far west Texas here, is all fracking earthquakes. These are due to injection of acid into sometimes directionally drilled wells that sometimes are directionally drilled up to a mile or more. And that's after they reach a total depth of 10, 12,000, maybe even deeper feet. Now, what we're seeing here is an oil field. But what I want to do is I want to zoom in so you can see how extensive first off it is. The last week, we've seen 80 three earthquakes in this area. I'm going to zoom in and show you all the oil pads. These are all oil drilling pads and that doesn't mean that there's one well drilled from each pads. Many times to save money there's several, several drilled from each pad. Now everything here in orange has occurred today including the largest earthquake in the swarm we've seen. This 5.1 magnitude earthquake. Now, one of the dead giveaways that these are fracking earthquakes is going to be the depth. 3.3 kilometers, 3.2 kilometers, 3.3, 3.0, 3.7. Usually, this is a deep one. Usually, you'll see them at 6 kilometers or shallower. Regularly, 5 kilometers or shallower. Uh, these do go a little bit deeper, but the actual hydrocarbons in this area are deeper. I want to show you all how they've ruined other areas. And this is a relatively new area that's not heavily drilled yet. But they are drilling deeper in this area. And they must be fracking this area much more significantly. In other words, pouring more acid into the directionally drilled wells to make the rocks more permeable so that they can recover more hydrocarbons. I'm against fracking, personally, even though I was in the oil and gas business for so many years. But I want to show you how few well sites there are. And obviously that's quite a, a few well sites. But if we move just a little bit over here, you can see now there's no fracking here because this is a much older field and much more developed. But you can see each and every one of these is a well site. And that is what this area could one day look like. Uh, I'd like to also show you this other area. Now that is a huge swarm. 83 earthquakes in one week. And a 5.1. Well, it's not the biggest fracking earthquake I've seen, but it's close. I've seen a 5.1. 8 magnitude fracking earthquake. Now y'all saw that area. That's a much older area. If we move over here where we're seeing a few earthquakes, y'all can also zoom in here. My cousin's actually out here working. He's a mud logger. Look at, this is again a much more developed area. Look at all the pads in this area. Now, of course the swarm is not as significant because this is heavily drilled and has been for years and years and years, as you can see. And when we back up, we see that they're, and we can do it here too, we see that they're, uh, 
these are all pads here too if you can see them it's a little bit different colored so we'll zoom in a little bit more but everywhere you see these uh, earthquakes and please notice the depths the hydrocarbons are a little bit deeper out in this area as well here's another swarm that we can look at right here uh, comparably 43 earthquakes and again this is all an area that's being fracked these are all for, uh, well pads if you will and as I indicated just because it's one well pad it could be several wells so there's a swarm and of course this swarm is much more concentrated but it's in an area that's being newly developed and again I'm against fracking but the acid being pumped into the rocks at these depths are causing these earthquakes this has nothing to do with any volcano in the area or any volcanic activity uh, I actually have been watching these earthquakes in Oklahoma for well over five years that area was leased in fracked well much earlier at least 10 years ago uh, 10 years earlier than West Texas and you'll still see earthquakes occurring up in Oklahoma again these are the Oklahoma fracking earthquakes all of them are fracking based those for, uh, were from this week but anyone that says that this is a substantial amount of earthquakes in this area they're absolutely correct this tells me that they're drilling deeper and they're fracking these wells heavily meaning they're pouring a ton of acid down there to make the rocks more permeable so that they can produce more of the hydrocarbons and this is probably what's called the Klein shale and by shale they mean it's a much tighter rock that well really wouldn't produce oil unless it was directionally drilled and fracked now yes this looks like a dangerous situation to me especially because they're going to care less about these earthquakes and continue to develop this area just like they did this area over here right look at this it's unbelievable but as they develop this area the fracking should should slow down again not volcanic related this is all about well man's actions this is man-made directional oil drilling with heavy fracking or heavy acid solution being poured down the boreholes to make the rocks more permeable to make the wells more efficient and cost effective with that said god bless you and yours i hope this stops and i hope fracking is outlawed period please share subscribe and always remember anything's possible in bizarro world